Monday fun day. Monday fun day. I'm, feel, I'm feeling quite good about Monday. Yeah. It gets a bad rap, doesn't it? Yeah, but yeah, it does. Like people are always like, oh, after the weekend, Monday, but it's like Monday. back to work. Uh. I mean, to be fair, we are just playing a game and live streaming. It's not that bad. <laughs> There's worse things to be doing on a Monday. There are worse things to be doing on a um, Monday. But I'm feeling quite good. Good for me. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> Bye. That's the end. That's the end of the stream. No, it's not. We're just getting started. Hello to everybody in the chat. Uh, how are you today? Hopefully you're having a good Monday uh, too. If not, hopefully we can make it better. Yeah. By playing oh, some lovely. PlayStation games. Isn't that nice? That's a lovely start. I am, I am nice. Uh, it's fantastic to see so many of you in the chat already. Uh, even though we've just got started, of especially, of course, our fantastic moderation team. Thank you for being here, moderators. We couldn't do it without you. We could, it would just be a mess. It would be horrible <laughs> out there, like a war zone. Um, today, Rosie and I are going to be playing uh, Darksiders Genesis. Yes. Which is a game that I saw at E3 last year with Nathan. And I must admit, I wasn't particularly excited about the appointment, but I watched them play the game and I was like, oh, this looks really good fun. Yeah. Um, it's a kind of a top-down action RPG mm -hmm. hack and slash kind of a game in the Darksiders universe. Um, but you can play it co op if you want. Yeah. yeah, isn't this the first time a Darksiders game's been co op? Yeah, something? it is. And it's also the first time playing, you can play as one of these characters, and I can't remember which one it is. The characters are War and Strife. War and Strife. And War, one of them, what I think it's Strife, hasn't been, hasn't been played before in, in the Darksiders games yet. Oh, really? So, yeah, so this is the first time. Uh, and the good thing is, if you're playing single player, you get to play as both the characters. You can switch as you like. And if you're playing co op, obviously, one of you takes control of one, one of you takes control of the other. So. What we thought we'd do is play the game from the start today. Mm -hmm. I'll play for like an hour, and then maybe for like the last bit of the stream, I'll summon Rosie, and we'll see how it works in, in split screen. Yes. Woo! Woo! Any questions? Good. Let let us have them. Uh, we're right at the start of the game here. We ha we have to infiltrate Samael's fortress. Not samurai, as Rosie <laughs> thought it was. <laughs> I read a samurai and I was like, oh look, samurai. And Dave was like, Rosie, there are no samurai. There's no samurai. Uh, it's Samael Jackson. Samael Jackson. Samael Jackson. So um, let's crack on. Also, I mean, we were being maybe a bit too loud, but does anybody recognize the voice actors? Because yes. Rosie does, and she, she's not sure who they are. I think it's War's voice actor who I recognize, and it's driving me up the wall. I swear I've heard his voice somewhere before, but I'm not sure. Let's listen. His enemies are many, but few could muster the forces to attack him directly. Well, guess it's not going to be an in and out conversation then. I not recognize likely. War. Well, one thing's for sure, we aren't using the front door. Let's get closer and see what we find. Yeah. Yeah, oh my god, please, so if someone are. can Woo. tell me or look up the voice then. Look, my lovely, lovely, lovely horse. My lovely horse. We'll get in trouble if we keep singing that. <laughs> so we won't do that. But yes, you can ride your horse as well, which I'm a big fan of. That's so cute. It is. And let you just get off. Ooh, That's me. so convenient as well because a horse is so much quicker. This is me, a Strife. Strife is a ranged character. He has guns. Also melee, melee abilities. And War is big on the melee. Oh, big on the melee. Yeah, look and he at those swings. He has a kind of a, a ghost hook, it's called, for grabbing. So, uh, yes, does anybody recognize... Those Looks those like voice actors. We've got a Liam O'Brien for War, and I know that people Samuel say it's uh, Ryan Comfort says War is Gara from Naruto. Sadly, I've never watched Naruto, so don't know him from that. Um, just give me all the video game names that he's done, <laughs> <laughs> and then one of them, whoever whoever gets the name that I recognise him from, will win a lucky prize of my love. <laughs> <laughs> See, even Elvis press play says so definitely recognise both voices. Well, there you go. But maybe Elvis press play watches Naruto and or what else? I can't remember what else he was from. So I've already played this first hour. Uh huh. So hopefully I won't be terrible at the game. It's qu it does get quite intense. I think there's a lot to learn, which I like. You know, it's not. I said hack and slash, but actually it gets really really deep with yeah. like learning move sets and things. Uh, these little question marks are tool tips. So this is a summoning stone where you can summon another player. So later on, which will we'll, be me, we'll get one of those and we'll summon Rosie. I've set this up as a kind of like a private game, so no one can join on who isn't invited. Um, 
So yeah, it'll just be Rosie getting invited at some point. I can't. Oh my god, Domino just got the name that I recognize him from. He's Orlando in Catherine, and I've recently been playing Catherine. He's the voice actor for War. Well, there you go. There we go. Well done, Domino. You get the Domino lucky prize. Domino gets the prize. That's why. Of my love. That's why he's the moderator. Oh my god, as soon as you said, I was like, oh my god, I can picture him. I can picture him at the bar with his hat. There we go. Now, now I'm fulfilled. Picture him at the bar with his hat. Yeah, the, yeah. <laughs> he does wear a hat, and he is at the bar a lot. Well, that would. That, that would explain why you can picture him doing those things. There we go. Well, now, I've, now my, my need to know the voice actor is fulfilled. <laughs> okay, so we're looking to infiltrate Samael's... Oh, that's nice. Fortress. So it's not, it's not completely linear, this game. I thought maybe it would just be, you know, follow the path, down you go. Uh -huh. But actually, there is, a, there is a fair bit of exploration. Oh, nice. At okay. At some point, we'll get um, a map, access to a map, I think, and we'll be able to have a look. So how, what, what kind of, are you a demon? Are you an alien? Just because there's a lot of spooky smoke coming off the horse. Right. So I'm like, <laughs> you're like that, that's not a normal horse. I don't horse. think it's a completely normal horse. I think that's a good spot, uh, Rosie. Yeah, it's not, it's not a completely normal ho horse. And it disappears as well into, into thin it's air. It's a good spot. Well right. done. Not a lot of people pick up on that. <laughs> I think it's just a normal horse. Um, no, you're not a normal guy. Well, I mean, one of these is called War and one of these is called Strife. So in Darksiders, and I must admit, if you saw our Darksiders 3 stream um, late last year, a few months ago anyway, I think I streamed with L. Made a lot of people very annoyed because I was not very good at uh, oh combat. Oh dear. Yeah, so they'll love this. Um, you, In those games you play as the Horsemen of the Apocalypse. Okay. Which are kind of like, I think they're like God... They're like god, like envoys from gods. She's like, she fights the seven deadly sins or something, isn't it? One of them, yeah. One of them fights the seven deadly sins. Oh, one of them, okay, right. Like, so there's four of them. Oh, okay, So that's right. why, like, this is two of them, War and Strife. Uh -huh. I think em Envy, well, no, Envy's got to be a deadly sin, hasn't she? I don't know. Someone in the chat will explain better than I am. The law of Darksiders. But that's why we have a horses anyway, because we are horsemen. Okay, right. So is that kind of like your... It's my, it's my favourite, mo my favourite, no, it's, yeah, <laughs> well it's just my favourite mode of transport, really. My favourite mode of transport, so now just I just call myself a horseman. Just, uh, yeah, just love, love getting on and off my horse. I'm a walkman. You're not a walkman. As in the, not as in the company. Like Sony. Yeah, no, I, <laughs> I just thought that, I was like, hang on, there's already a device <laughs> called a walkman. Let's I was see like, I, I like walking. Cool <laughs> so I could be a walkman. You're a pedestrian. I'm <laughs> We've got a word for that. But I don't want to be a pedestrian. I'm sorry, you are. Oh. Boring as it is. <laughs> mysterious objects. I found a few mysterious objects in my playthrough so far. Not sure what they're for. They're, they're, magi they're mysterious. Okay, so we can double jump and Ooh. fly a little bit. Not fly. Fall gracefully. Fall gracefully, yeah. I we are falling with style. Right, so we've got the map of this area now. So we'll have a quick look and you can see, interestingly... It doesn't tell you. I find this interesting anyway. Mm -hmm. As far as I could tell, it doesn't tell you where you are on the map. Like, it, it tells us we're, oh, we're in this flashing area. Okay. But there is no icon for, for us. So, I don't think anyway. Unless it's that one. I, I've been looking at this a lot. And, and you can never find yourself. No. But we, if the area that you're at flashes. So, you have to kind of like look at the... You know, you have to look for landmarks and things to try and figure out where you are. Oh, that's really Which cool, I, actually. I think it is quite cool. It's something I've not seen before. It's like, because if you actually had a map, then well, you wouldn't be on the map, would you? Good, like? good point. I, I like that. That's awesome. Not unless it was, you know, Harry Potter, which was... <laughs> yeah, then you have your little footprint. Feet, but the footprints all over the place. Feet prints. Feet yeah, prints. No, yeah, exactly. What was that? The, uh, the what was it? What the... What's the map called? Um, Memorial Orders Map. Was Marauder's it? map. That's right. And they go. I summon. I summon. I, I, are you having? Are you I struggling today, today. Rosie? Are you right? <laughs> I was. was I it a big weekend. It was. No, I watched the Sonic movie. Oh. So I've, now I've done that. I went to see your boy Sonic. And how is he? Did, yeah. my, did you send my love? I did send your love. I always send your love to Sonic, Dave. Thank you. It was a fun time. Yeah? Yeah, it was us. And like, we, we, my my boyfriend and I were the only adults there at this viewing. Okay. Because we went prime time mid-afternoon on a nice. Sunday. So 
so it was like, I was like, I know this is coming. I was like, but we're still going to have an awesome time. Was it well, you know, frequented? Were there, were there, was it full even though not with adults? Yeah, actually, it was pretty busy. It was pretty busy. Well, it was like, it was a bunch of dads and their kids. A bunch of dads. Yeah, so li literally, like... So it there feels like a dad's movie. <laughs> there wasn't like any mums or anything. It was right. just like <laughs> loads of dads and their kids. And I was just like, oh, this is sweet. Oh, go on. Go on, here we go. Yes. Boom, boom, sucker. Boom, boom. He's a very cool horseman. Isn't he? Like way more cool than me. And I'm not even a horseman. <laughs> but I want to be a horseman. I'd like to. Do you have any uh, experience of horse riding? Um, I've got like a friend who's really into horse riding. Okay. So I always hit like, I see her like in her horseman gear and stuff like that. Uh, I rode a pony when I was younger once. Uh, apart from that, I've not really been much of like a horse. Me neither. I've, I've got no horse information to share. No. Nothing. So not, I'm a very bad horseman. I think we've just picked up a power um, for war, which reminds me we could be war. We could be war. Oh. Let's do that for what a, a bit. good name. Imagine that, having a baby, and then what, it's like, what should we call our lovely son? War! war. 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 Yeah, exactly. Uh, so, a little bit of character overview. Strife, agile, uh, and equipped to control the battlefield from a distance. War. He doesn't care. Into the thick of battle. Yes. Dominating. War! Chaos eater. Uh, so, Strife and War can discover new ammo types. Lovely stuff. Strife and War build up their wrath meters. I'm really bad at using these powers, so okay. I'm going to try and do it. Um, basically, if you hel hold L1, it's a modifier. Oh, well, we've got a little cutscene. <laughs> <So. laughs> Great. Ruined. Ruined that. Uh, okay, let's, let's hold be L1. War. So, you can see that his, was really his quick a power. Though. Oh, nice. Nice. So powerful uh, stuff. Um, and if I move the right stick, you can see it opens this menu, which kind of, for Strife, it, it's different ammo types for uh -huh. your guns. And for War, I guess it's different moves. With this one, we just got a splitter, which lets me do this. Ooh. Boom, nice. Big fan of that. Oh, hi. Epic green blade happening. Oh, War is a good character. I am a fan. I was going to say I'm a fan of War then, which I'm, you know, <laughs> just not. It's in the character, the character. The character, no, you misunderstood. Seeing how the chat's doing. Dragon of Dojima said, I've been horseback riding. It was fun. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Adaj says, call me what you will, but Dave has really smooth skin. Would you, say you've got <laughs> okay. would you say you've got smooth skin? Uh, I mean, I'd like to think I do. I don't know that... I, I don't really have anything to compare it to. I don't think I do. But, you know, I, I, I suppose it's a compliment. Thank you. <laughs> it's the camera. The camera lies. It yeah, adds, the camera lies. It adds pounds and it, it eradicates wrinkles. <laughs> adds pounds, but it gets rid of your wrinkles. Yeah, we had to pay... You know, we, we bought these special cameras that eradicate wrinkles. Make us like 10 years younger. We've got, you know, Dan's back in the office today. Yeah. So he's, uh, he's working magic in the in the gallery, making yes. sure that none of my wrinkles are showing. <laughs> Unlike me in the gallery where you had to mansplain <laughs> <laughs> how to try and do Rosie, things. it was not mansplaining. <laughs> and I was like, that's not a feature for me. <laughs> Don't make me explain mansplaining <laughs> like a man would. <laughs> Oh, God. I was just being helpful. Just Big being Boss friendly. asks, how many plats has Dave got now? Three. Three plats. That's right. Count them. Three. three. You've nearly caught up with Rob, haven't you? I think Rob's on five. But Ooh. soon, to, if he's, you know, he's talking a big talk at the moment, Rosie. He is, soon yeah. to be six. And it's a big one. It's the big one. The big one. It's the one that Rob will tell you uh, has been holding him back from getting other plats. Yeah, <laughs> you know, so he, it, it's it's Skyrim that we're talking about. Rob, uh, if you've watched any of his streams, has been hoping he's been working towards getting the Skyrim platinum for ages, and he's now really, really close. And I think it's kind of got in the way of some of his other platinum dreams because he's just been back he just absorbed into the world of Skyrim. Exactly, once again. he can't concentrate on anything else. He's just he's 
he's just playing Skyrim all the time. So um, if he can get that one done, I'm sure A, he'll bring it to everybody on a, on a live stream, mm -hmm. uh, and B, it might open the way for That's a few a more. So where are we going? Okay, careful. gliding. So yeah, I don't know how. I'm, I mean, like I'm catching Rob definitely because this time last year I had zero. That is very true, but yeah. I don't think he'll be too worried. You've got three in a short span three. of time. It's not bad. It's not bad. That's not bad at all. The Rocket League one was was completely, you know, just like ready to go, basically. I had to do very little to, to actually to make that happen. Yeah. It all just happened naturally. Um, but I, I'm, I'm very proud of my Horizon plat. And I'm pretty. I'm quite proud of my modern warfare plat. Actually. Yeah, Thank they're very. You'd be proud of them. Thank you very much. I am. What's your next plat? Do you think? My next plat. Well, I've got. What? Because I'm always working on Yakuza Kiwami at the moment. Right. Although I've hit a point in the game where, like, I need to finish what's known as the completion list, and that's basically like doing everything to its full potential. And I'm in the part where you've got to go to the casino, and so that's a lot of like. Luck, and for example, you've got to like earn 5,000 points in one game. But oh. I've like got an item that will help. But then apart from that, the other day I spent an hour and a half, and I just wasn't getting anywhere because I just had bad luck. And right. I was like, why does the platinum depend on luck? Right. <laughs> uh, so that one's gonna take me a bit longer than I thought. You literally have to have luck in a casino, like as in. As in like you like. Is you it know, an actual resource, or is it just you mean you just have to get lucky? You just have to get lucky. Oh wow. That like, you know, stressful. when you're putting, when it's like, oh, is it red or black? What do you want to put right. a bet on? And then you're like, oh, I'm going to guess it's going to go red. And then they're like, nah, uh, uh, sorry, you mate. You guessed wrong. You guessed wrong. And I was like, oh. <laughs> so that one's going to take me a bit longer. But probably my next plat, I'm still working on Crash Bandicoot 2. Um, I also decided to pick up Kingdom Hearts 3, maybe plat that just before Final Fantasy 7 because I need an RPG fix. And... I was just like, rather than start one new and then be late for Final Fantasy VII Remake, I'll do Kingdom Hearts that I've already played and maybe just try and get the plat for it. Okay. So who knows? Who knows? Who knows? No, no commitment there. No commitment. Fair enough. I must admit, I, I don't like the idea of committing to a platinum. Like, it's something we have to do a bit more at work just because, you know, we try and plan Platinum Monday live streams and things. But Yeah. The you idea of you know the idea of saying I'm gonna get this one next it, like fills me with dread. I know. So you say it and then like you can start it and then something can take like so much longer or it's more hard and you're like oh no. Yeah, exactly. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I might get next, if if anything. Um, was thinking a lot of people were like, and I, I really enjoyed the game, uh, the the Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order Platinum. Yeah. Um, which I was de I'm definitely tempted by. As I said, I really enjoyed the game. I don't have loads left to do in it. Yeah. Uh, aside from that, one of our regular viewers, Tiny Flamingo, got in touch today and said that loads of people, loads of our our audience are getting together and replaying or playing through Bloodborne at the moment. Going for oh, the I really want to go for the plot on Bloodborne. Literally, that's like once I've done what I want to do in my like... See, you know how I always play multiple games at once because I'm a terrible person and I can't stick to one? Right. So I've got like... I've tried to limit myself by having like the physical games underneath my TV so I can phys physically see what I'm playing. Right. And I'm like, once I've done those, I want to boot up Bloodborne again. And also because my boyfriend really wants to watch it after all the hype I give it. And I'm just like, go for a plat for it. You're right. I mean, I... I I made, you know, this kind of statement. It feels like a weird thing to say because I'm sure loads of people do this, but I'm like, you know, I never really wanted to get a platinum, wasn't really interested in it. And then, you know, getting my first platinum did change that to some degree, I think. Yeah. But I, I think I'm only interested in getting platinums for games that I really love. Yeah. Uh, and so far, that's absolutely true. I, I love Horizon, Rocket League, and Modern Warfare. I think they're all fantastic games. Yeah. And Bloodborne was one of the first like PS4 games that I absolutely fell in love with I yeah, think. So, yeah, that was yeah, same with me. And so it would it absolutely feels it fits the bill in that regard. Like it's definitely a game that that I love. 
So Imagine that as a stream. Like, we both get the same final trophy. Let's say it's like do a, a boss or something. And then we have to see who gets the platinum first. Oh, a platinum race. Imagine but, like, that. At the same time with one trophy there. Yeah. That would be cool. Well, imagine that. That would be pretty cool. Uh, oh, back on your horse. Oh, I've got war. Obviously, it's war's horse now. War horse. War horse. Um, he's very fiery and cool. He is very or fiery she. and cool. Yeah. We got to name it. Does, does our horse have a name? Uh, I think it's War Horse. That's what we're going with. <laughs> it's just War Horse. I'm still, as I said, like I should have been using, I, I'm still learning all the stuff that you can do, which is, which are many things. I should be, should have used my horse sooner. But, uh, um, Mira Kerr just said play co-op and I just want to remind everyone that we will hopefully be playing co-op later on if Dave doesn't hulk the controller. Yeah, well, we'll, we'll need a second controller, Rosie. Yeah, either way. He's got both. Sure. <laughs> I've got both. I've got lock and key. <laughs> so we, we will be doing co-op later. We just wanted to show it off single player as well, because yes. a lot of people, you know, will just play it single player, I'm sure. Like, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Uh, uh, this is a game I'm, I've really enjoyed what I've played so far, and I think... Will I... But will I find someone to go through the whole thing co-op with? Yeah. I don't know. That's the thing. Sometimes it can be someone who you don't expect to play it with and sometimes you're like, yeah. you are my friend who will play Darksiders with me. And it's quite a big, it's a big commitment. Yeah, it's a big commitment. Feels like a lunchtime game. It'll be a you and Nath game at lunchtime. On the beanbags. On the, oh yes, the bean. Have we talked about the beanbags I don't yet? know if we have. <sighs> Should we talk about the beanbags? We should go on. Okay, we've explain. Been, it's been very exciting because we've decided to spruce up the office a bit more now that we've done the new set and everything. And one of those has been our downstairs space, which before was just a sofa, really. And the table was in the corner. But now Dave has done... An, oh, and a TV. <laughs> but now Dave's done an amazing job. And we've got beanbags. You no, have done it. an amazing stop job. It. We've got beanbags. We've got a light now. And like... <laughs> a light. We've got shelves. <laughs> it looks... Great! I've got a big light that's like blue and pink, and it's awesome. And it's all thanks to Dave. Bean bags are the big one. I mean, it's 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 a lot thanks to me, but it's been a team effort coming up with ideas for what we might have down there and stuff. But the bean bags, the bean bags were Rob's dream. Actually, yeah. To be well, fair. Literally, I remember when we were discussing about what we wanted. Rob was just like bean bags because um, there were some bean bags at the EGX show if you were there, and uh, by the PlayStation area. And we fell in love with them. And then Rob said bean bags. And then we were all just like, at first it was like, oh my god, imagine if we got bean bags. And it was like, we should so get bean bags. It's a bit, you know, it's a bit cliche, isn't it? Bean bags. They're a bit like, oh god, you're one of those, those offices with bean bags. <laughs> but uh, actually, they're the best thing ever. They so are the best thing ever. Shut up. Also, Even yeah, we were totally, um, we were totally influenced by by PlayStation events. If you've ever been to... Come on, come closer, friends. If you've ever been to a, a PlayStation event and sat on those beanbags... Oh, they're so good. That's We literally got in touch with PlayStation and said, which what beanbags do you have? Oliver Bath says, do you have Windows warmth and food, guys? Are you okay? No, we don't have any of those. Don't ask that, Rosie. But we have beanbags. Rosie's fine. <laughs> don't you worry. Don't you worry. Rosie's able to leave anytime she wants. I am, but I don't want to leave the beanbags. The beanbags are like the happiest place on earth for now. We've actually, I mean, you might remember, we've got, we've had too much warmth. I'm actually a bit too warm right now, if I'm honest. I'm quite toasty. But we've got the, air, we've got the aircon now. Yeah. So we should, we should be able to. We're going up in the world, aren't we? Yeah, it's like Look new at us. Year, beanbags, new start. aircon. Okay. What else? Well, I've Set. got a new power for strife. Nice. Fire a strong piercing bullet. Can be charged up three levels. Lovely stuff. Attack power is permanently increased. Lovely, lovely, lovely. So, got you. Thank you. Okay. So, hot streak is the thing that came up there, which I haven't explained, which is basically when you, I think, you know, chain together a few kills, you get a kind of, you go into like a, a power what, power mode, like a wrath yeah. mode, where you, for a short amount of time, you, or you're extra powerful. Um, so, I'll go back to Strife and we can look at his, his Crazy new move, mode. which I think, Crazy. What, so we've got... Standard shot on R2, which we've always had, and now this is the new one. Charge shot on R on R1, right? Is that right? It's R1. Yeah, it is R1. It definitely is. Or is it? Or is it? We'll find out. 
Oh, get those chain grappling hooks in. You oh know. my god. Cara Langford said you need a lava lamp. I <gasps> said we needed a big lava Did lamp you? in the corner. Yeah, but you said like a big one. Yeah, like a big one, like a shark's tail. Like a shark's tail? Like, like you know the film Shark's Tail? Right, okay. I thought you meant the there's size of a shark's tail. <laughs> no, the film Shark Tail. There's one scene where there's a giant lava lamp. Since I was a kid, I was always like, wow, imagine having a lava lamp that big. Okay. So now if I think of a big lava lamp, I think of that scene. We, ha we, we have got a neon sign. We do. Now. Which is amazing. Which is good. That's We've got, imagine, just sitting on the beanbags, looking at the neon sign. It's basically all you need. Yeah, pretty much. I've never been to somewhere. That there's, a, there's a sofa there somewhere and a PS4 there somewhere. Somewhere. Oh, that was a good save. Thank you. That was, was close. Yeah, I was a bit... I was a bit proud when I got there. Oh, it's a very, very satisfying game, this game, to play. Just, you feel very powerful. Okay, it looks like a good game, like, you know, if you're having a troubled day and then you're just like, right, just go slashy, slashy, slash. Yes, exactly. And, and at least, to begin with, the amount that I've played, it's, um, well, like you say, it's quite relaxing and it's just... You can just play it, you know, and you can think about other things a bit. You can talk to your friend. Yeah. Your, your colleague. Yeah, your colleague. <laughs> <laughs> when uh, will that joke not be a joke anymore? <laughs> Rosie, it's part of access. It's part of access. Now. It's, it's, it's part of our law. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my God. Nicola Jurikin says we need an aquarium. Oh god! I'm we should so get some fish. Let's not br don't bring up fish around Nathan. Why? Because I used to have an aquarium, and he really? has he has a very poor recollection of it, which I dispute. Why well, do you have a poor recollection of it? Oh, I'm not bringing it up, Rosie. <laughs> you can talk to Nathan <laughs> I'm about so it. I'm so going to ask Nathan no, about it. It's not true. His his memories of of uh, my aquarium. I always had a uh, fish growing up. I always had an aquarium. I love, love, love. Being surrounded by the fish. I love nature. I was yeah. going to say fish, but actually it's just all nature. Big fan. I had a friend who had like a, uh, an aquarium, but she always got really big fish. Like, and then whenever we, like, we went around for a sleepover, I just remember seeing all these beautiful fish. Right. That she like adored to the moon and back. She was like, look at my fish. Well, they were nice. good times. You don't see you don't see a lot of aquariums these days. I, I know, don't, I don't it's sad. Like. Uh, what's out here? There's definitely something out here. Careful now. No, that's Careful. A Careful. I believe oh. I some people in the chat now saying they want. Oh yeah, here we go. Yoshi Roshi. <laughs> Yoshi Roshi says I second another access tour. An a oh, a new tour. A new tour. Not a lot's changed. Well, I mean, we've been saying that, but a lot's changed. I've got no idea what a trickster key is, but I've got one now. Ooh. Um, Maybe we need a trickster with it. A new tour. I mean, we haven't done a tour of this office ever. We always plan to, but... <laughs> we'll just, we want it to be prettier first. Yeah, it's quite a lot of... Uh, it's surprising how much work it is keeping an office looking not rubbish. <laughs> so we have to wait until that that's happened. Uh, right, I keep forgetting. I'm always like running a little bit slowly. I'm like, God, I wish I could go faster. You've got a horse man. You have a horse. You're a horse man. Literally a horse man. A I think I'm going to go horse. over that blue area, but I want to just make sure there's nothing up here. What blue area? It's all the way back there. Oh, I think okay. Now, okay. This is where I need to look at the area map. So where are we? So we're on. We're here. We're heading towards Blackstone Wall. Is that where we are? It doesn't seem like that's where we are. Looks like there's a lot of things down a plank to the left. Down a plank to the left. Well, as in, like, you see where you've got the, the main poly bit, and then to the left it's got, like, different shades of grey. Over here? Yeah. Like, right. different shades of grey, which makes me think you, like, go down a level. Right, yes, I see what you're saying. See what yes. I mean? Yeah, D the poly bit. The poly bit. Uh, let's check our quests while we're here. Ooh, I've done something. I've defeated demons besieging Samuel Jackson's fortress. I'll claim that. Okay, that's cool. So it's got like little in-game quests that are on top of just, you know, just the actual missions. Mm -hmm. Okay, 
I don't know if this is the way we want to go, but we're going to go this way. This is what I mean about... Oh, no, I've definitely been here, haven't I? Yeah. Yeah, that's here. where you came from, wasn't right. it? Right, exactly. Yeah, so I think I know I'm going to go over that, the blue thing, which I of which I spoke. Of which I spoke. I have spoken. I have spoken. I am strive. <laughs> uh, Dakota Donnelly asks, Dave, do you remember doing that ninja VR game and putting dubstep over it? Nin the fruit ninja? <laughs> Maybe. That was Nathan who did that. I mean, he put that. I'm in the video. Nathan added dubstep to it. Yes. Uh. It was, it was um, quite offensive, really. Oh, no. <laughs> well, it's no, it's all right. But fruit yeah, fruit ninja's a lot of fun in VR. Oh, fruit ninja is so much fun in VR. I remember I played it at my brother's. I was like, wow, this is awesome. The problem is, you do look like a bit of an idiot whilst not, you know, to those people who aren't in VR. Yeah, but that doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You always look amazing, no matter what you do. <laughs> Rosie, that sounded like the most sarcastic <laughs> kind of... Did it to come off as sarcastic? <laughs> okay, yeah. Well, I don't know if I can trust you anymore. Trust me, with your whole heart and being, you look amazing when you do things in the it's my, it's my smooth skin. <laughs> smooth skin, exactly. Destroy that. That is a very pleasing gun. Oh I, I wish I, I hope I couldn't have used it because I'd like to have used it. I don't think I think it was helping your enemies. So has anybody else in the chat uh, seen seen Sonic yet? Are there any any thoughts on it? Do you think you're going to see Sonic? Um, I'm not like a huge Sonic fan. Mm. As in, you know, I played Sonic on the Mega Drive right back in the day, and I well, I absolutely loved it. But I've not. I've not followed Sonic's career, His you know, career, not, yeah. not with a lot of interest. Like Sonic for me is a nice character from my past, but not much more than that. So I'm not like, what I'm saying is I'm not clamoring to see it. I'm not like, we've got to go on Wednesday. Come on. See, I always go to Sonic if I want just some cheesy, lighthearted fun. And I got some light-hearted fun from the film with lots of cheesy moments. So well, it was that's exactly what you wanted. Those exactly. are the two things you wanted. Exactly. So when my friends were like, what did you think of it? I was like, it's exactly what I wanted it to be. I, I've got to be honest, Rosie. This does sound like um, a classic Rosie, like finding the positives in a negative. <laughs> <laughs> it's making me think that actually you didn't think it was that good. No, I did. No, yes. I really did enjoy my time with it. Okay. If anything, I think my boyfriend and I found it funnier than the kids did in the cinema. Okay. And also, Jim Carrey in it's great. He's a great Dr. Robotnik, and it's good to kind of see Jim Carrey go all out and fully look like he's enjoying a role. Right, okay. So it kind of reminds, it reminds everyone says it reminds them a lot of like 90s Jim Carrey. Okay. You know, where he's just, and um, I believe that the directors and the people who made the film. Sometimes they were like, okay, Jim, these are like the main lines. Everything else, go ham. Just be the character and have fun with it. So there's a lot of scenes where Wait, it's what, just... What was this? Go ham? Was it? Yeah. Is that, is that a saying? I think it is. Okay. I've heard it. I mean, unless I just made one up, but I I'm would, pretty sure it's one. I wouldn't be surprised. Like, but I uh, know. Okay, go ham. Yeah, go ham with it. Go ham with it. Just ham. Please chat. Now tell me if that is... Has anyone heard that before? Go ham. Go ham. Now I'm really in the mood for some ham. I'm always in the mood for some ham. Unless we're talking about acting, when I, in which case I don't really know what, what, we, what, we, what that means. <laughs> Go acting with ham. Oh god, he was judged. Oh, judged, judged, judged by, by war. war. That is, you don't want that. That's embarrassing, isn't it? He's been judged. Oh, here you go. Double EMP says, can confirm, go ham. Go ham. I'd like to know about the etymology of go ham. Where does it come from? I know, I what wonder. What does it mean? Does it yeah. just go, it just means go wild. I can, yeah, like so you go, just say, yeah, knock like, yourself out. Yeah, like, yeah, knock yourself Try out. Try some stuff. Like, go ham. Go ham. Absolutely. Knock yourself out with ham. I like that crazy panda eight says, you're not confused, Rosie. Go ham indeed. I will go, go ham. ham. Go ham indeed. You, you, you made that sound very rousing, like Churchill or something. <laughs> go ham. We will go ham on the beaches. If I ever become the Prime Minister, I will tell everyone to go ham. 
It's fine, guys. Just go ham. Have you got any um, desire to become prime minister? Nah. Okay. Not really. I've got to be honest, Rosie. I'm pleased. I, <laughs> I think I would be concerned. What if I was prime? Why would you be concerned? Because you'd be going ham, and I would not know what you were going to do next. <laughs> I, think I think it would be a great time. A great time. <laughs> <laughs> is this your? Uh, this is your. Um, Vote kind of me like for prime minister, and we'll your, have a great your time. Speech. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be a poster. We'll all have a great time. We'll all have a great. It will be fine. It will be fine. <laughs> that is amazing. <laughs> Rosie's kind of like tagline. Vote for me. Vote it will be, be fine. fine. <laughs> oh, that oh, seems. That man. seems unfair. That was close. Luckily, there was no, there was no cost whatsoever to that. Thing. There you go. Oh. He does this. Oh. I've not figured out the how to land. On, all got a on, bit too the excited. The there we go. Okay, right, fine. Thank you. Yeah, Becky Joe's got the idea. She said, "Vote for Rosie to be Prime Minister. The world will be a much rosier place. Go ham." Oh, that's a much better uh, line. I think <laughs> we'll have some fun. Whatever. It you will can. be fine. It will be fine. That's oh, right. No. Oh no! Oh no! Won't be fine. Ah. Oh, he just got. Burn. He did. That's how he resets. He's oh, come on now. There we go. <laughs> John Gingras said, "Keep calm and ham on." Ham on. Ham on. Which is, did he say that with a J? Because in Spanish, the Spanish for ham is ham on. Is it? Yeah. Ah. So it could have been a really good joke there. It may have just been not a joke at all. I don't know. Do you know a lot of Spanish? See. Si. Yeah. No, not really. <laughs> I, I was trying to think of anything else that I know. A tiny, I know about that. What, a tiny? No, I know a tiny amount. Oh, okay, I thought See, you said I know what like a tiny is in Spanish. I was like, why out of everything in Spanish do you know what a I tiny mean, is? I mean, I might. It's something like poquito. Poquito? Something. Yeah, something like that. Oh, that's adorable. I don't know. Does that, are there any Spanish speakers watching? Yes, chat, please educate us. I'm sure there must be. The there may even be some people in a, a natively Spanish-speaking country. Yeah, that's true. So, ooh, nice. War doesn't Look care at. about your scaffolding. War wants war. War wants war. It is quite cool being war. He's a very hello. like. <laughs> hello. Imagine just minding your own business and then a someone, giant blue a, hand. a big ghost hand just comes in. Have some of that. I can't be willing to mess around. I want to show off those powers. What other powers does he have? Just just square. Just L1 and square. For okay. now, anyway. For now. For now. That's what are these mysterious objects you've been I picking up? I don't know. I'm hoping that once we get a bit further into the game, it will be some kind of currency or something. Uh-huh. Don't know what this is either. This area. I think, I think you're restricted in what you can do within that sort of circle. circle. Oh, is it now that it's going to be like, this is a boss fight? Pekino, Snake 1988 says Pekino, not Pokito. Pekino? Pokino. Oh, but tiny. For a tiny. Oh, and of course we've got Tiny Flamingo in the chat, so everyone's being like, oh, it's like Tiny Flamingo, what would her name be in Spanish? Exactly. I only know well, one word in Spanish. That's a good question. I'd really like to know what the Spanish for Flamingo is. Yeah, then we can, yeah. I bet it's just going to be flamingo. I know what the Spanish word is for guinea pig. That's the only Spanish word I remember. All right, tell me. Conejo de Indias. What? <laughs> I don't know. I think I pronounced it okay. Conejo de Indias. De Indias. Yeah. Well, that's very cool. Because we did Spanish when I was at primary school. It was like Spanish or French. Right. And then I loved guinea pigs and I had a guinea pig. So I asked my teacher what it was. Because she was like, talk about your pet. And I was like, I've got a guinea pig. What's guinea pig in Spanish? <laughs> and now I, it's always just been engraved in my memory. And I used to go home to mum and be like, mum, where's the conejo de India? <laughs> <laughs> I'm really proud. That's great. Ginger I love that. Him. I love that. What was your guinea pig called? Ginger. After the ginger, ginger on Chicken Run. Oh, really? Yeah. Fantastic character. A then, brilliant film. I, oh, it's a fan, one of my favourites. One I of love my favourites. Yeah, it's a great, it's a great movie. And then my brother had one and he called it Sparks after Spyro, the little dragon. Oh, yeah, that's nice. So we had Sparks and Ginger. Ginger lived for years. He was like 
The oldest guinea pig I've ever known. Really? Yeah, bless him. Oh no, he died. But it's fine. Okay, oh, this looks foreboding. Interact with fog door to proceed. Once past through fog, no can, no turn back. Okay, this feels like a boss time. Boss time! Boss time. Oh, Rodrigo Campos says Flamingo is Flamenco. Oh. So what, what was, so what was Tiny? Tiny? The dance. Tiny was... Volcano Flamenco. That's a good, a good or ring. I think it would be Flamenco Volcano. I'm not sure. That has got a good ring I don't know why it. I'm doing a weird sort of bow accent now, I should just say. Flamenco Volcano. And what was it again? Co Conejo, Co de, Conejo Indias. de Indias. So that would be Volcano Conejo de Indias. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's getting. Oh, it's Ooh. getting tough. And now you've got a big tough boss. Oh, look at that thing in its teeth. All right. Oh dear. Oh, okay. Oh, big swishy arm. All right. I'm gonna go. Gonna start ranged here. All right. Okay. Are you gonna? Oh, you're strife now. I was like. I've gone to strife. That's a good shout. Oh, he got me there. That seems unlikely. I thought I read it first as follow friend. And I was like, oh. <laughs> oh, oh. He just wants... He just wants some filling. Oh, speaking of friends as well, uh, I just want to quickly say to everyone who was at the Dreams launch event uh, last Thursday, thank you all for being so awesome. Rosie, was, that is a great shout. It was like a, we should have mentioned that. Yeah, it was really great to chill with everyone and just have a jolly good time with chips, burgers. <laughs> <laughs> and like just chatting yeah. and dreams. Anything else? It was a great having a good time with some chips and some burgers. <laughs> chips, burgers, playing dreams. It was really awesome and you guys were epic. Yeah, it was. So it thank was you for good. making it a lovely evening. Uh, we should explain, really. If you, were, if, if, if you don't know what we're talking about, uh, on Thursday last week, we were unable to stream, which hopefully you noticed because we were attending the Dreams launch event in London and uh, PlayStation were very kind in inviting us to turn it into a, a uh, oh no. Oh no. It's okay. I've still got war. Nice. Into turning it into a, an access community event. Yeah, and it was so awesome. So we released, I think it was, I think it was 50 tickets. Uh, through our community tab, which invited people to to sign up, and then they could come down and we basically just chat. We played really? played some dreams with everybody, yeah. and, and had a good chat with everyone. It was a really really nice time. So if you did come down for that, thank you very much for coming. I really hope you had a good time. Yeah, let definitely. Us know that if you did, uh, well, let us know if you didn't. If it's something we could have done differently, and uh, yeah, hopefully we'll be doing more. We'll see. But it was really, really good fun and it was really nice. Met some amazing people. And actually, if you've watched Rob's Friday feature last week, um, one of the entries, it was ultra hard trophies. Part three. Yes. One of the trophies that he mentions, he found out about at the event. Yeah. We met a lady called Michelle who has 159 platinums. Oh my God, was that many? Yeah, which we were very impressed by. And uh, she said, I asked her what her proudest platinum was. And she said it was the Virtua Tennis 2009 because of that one trophy that's in that, in that video. I think it's called Gold Medalist. And it's ridiculously, <laughs> just ridiculously Wasn't it hard. like reaching a certain rank, but you have to do it in online matches or something? It is a, there's a, yeah, you had to do, you basically had to get a gold medal in lots of things. So it wasn't just one thing and you you get a trophy it was like you know you had to do eight things for this one bronze trophy yeah and one of the things you had to do yeah was yeah take that one of the things you had to do was win i think it was 750 online matches but if any if your opponent quit during mm. the match it didn't count as a win oh no so you had to win actually 750 you had to have a fair match you had to have a fair match and i'm sure a lot of people as they do rage quit so yeah, they're like, oh no, this person's too good. I don't want to ruin my rank. I'm going to quit. Exactly. Uh, so what time is it? It's quarter past four, 45 minutes. I mean, I've done a boss now. So I'm thinking maybe the next time I see a summoning stone. Yeah. Should we get you in and yeah. see, see what we can do? <coughs> Let's get me in. 
Uh, there is a very important question in the chat, though, from Jedi Rider Gaming. Okay. He says, Dave, will you be playing Resident Evil 3? No. Yes, you will. We're going to nope. have a great time. No, I absolutely will not. <laughs> why not? You love Resident Evil 2. I'll tell you why, Rosie. You know why. It's why? because Rosie made a, a video recently on the channel, um, which is, how many is it? Five creatures? Mm -hmm. Yes, five. We'd hate but, but love, love to, see. to see in uh, Resident Evil 3. The remake, and I watched that video, and the very first thing is from the original are these spiders, <laughs> which are absolutely terrifying. <laughs> and I, I like, I don't want to play the original. There's no way I'm playing a remastered. It's not remastered, a remade, like version of that. But I mean, the spiders those horrible might not be spiders. In it. Oh, oh. They might not be in it, Dave. We don't know. Well, I know. Well, I hope they're not, <laughs> because. But that's that's me out. I don't. I honestly don't think I really enjoyed Resident Evil 2, but there's no spiders in it. Well, there were. Well, there's spiders in the original Resident well, Evil 2. Well, I didn't enjoy that one. Didn't play <laughs> that. One. I've enjoyed Resident Evil 2, the remake. Uh, but uh, yeah, I don't. No, not for me. Thank you. No, bye. What if I'm with you? We can have a. No. We can have a good old sesh. Maybe I'll watch you play, and then I could just, uh, if any point I feel uncomfortable, I'll just walk away. Just walk away, yeah. Just I keep forgetting I've got a horse. David, you're a horseman. Use the horse. Use the horse, Luke. Use the horse. Use the horse. What's the that? horse is very suiting for this area as well. Like he is. You know what the lava pit needs? A horse on fire. A lava horse. A lava horse. Uh. A door that pretentious can only lead to our boy Sam I L. Sneaking in was a good idea. Have we snuck in? I mean, it was pretty loud. Yeah, we didn't really sneak. <laughs> we didn't sneak. Oh. <laughs> oh, there we go. Approach. It was a strategic Still approach, maybe. Plenty along. Mm. Yeah, we did. Yeah, I like war. War's my kind of guy. Strife, you uh, idiot. You idiot. What do you think sneaking is? We've got a cutscene. Let's watch the cutscene. Yes. My lord, the council. <gasps> so we're working for the council. Guess you didn't hear us knocking. Ah, oh, horseman. What brings the loyal servants of the Council to my door? The Council believes you scheme with Lucifer against humanity, against the balance. Do you deny it? Lucifer's the devil. Yes. Such base villainy is beneath me. I admit, I am intrigued by your accusation. Unfortunately, I find myself a bit under siege at the moment. It's very amicable, By isn't Bullock? it? Yeah. How'd you manage to let a bottom feeder like that get the upper hand? No offense. An Some offense. question. I could venture, I guess. I told you this day would come, Samael. Mm -hmm. I, Moloch, have come to claim your head and your kingdom. Like his earrings. I was gonna say he looks amazing. We will continue our discussion after I drive my sword through Moloch's skull. Oh, okay. As you do. Oh, well, I guess that's fine. We'll have an answer to your question. If you could get that over with quickly. Oh, is he, is he just like teleported us away? Are they? They're having a fight now. What are we doing? We're just like watching. Hi. Watching. How are you doing? Well, that's well, very interesting. Is. Lucifer's I involved. I, I know. Lucifer's involved. Lucifer's involved. I always knew. He's at it again. Nathan Williamson says we need an Outlast 2 playthrough with Dave in charge. Nathan, come on now. It's been years. Surely I can I can escape Outlast 2 nope. now. There's no way I'm so playing I'm Outlast 2. Oh yeah, he sent us. So he did. He teleported us somewhere. Where are we? That's nice of him. I mean, I hope it was nice of him. Unless it's like a prison. I'm going to teleport you yeah, to the worst place I could think of. I hope there's some... Aha! A summoning stone! <gasps> da, 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 da. Are you already signed in, Rosie? Or we'll do that bit now. Let's have a look, yeah. Sign away. In comes Vivi. Okay. Uh, let's see. Split screen call, please. Press any button to join. I'm in. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Look at us partying. Woo. Oh, that's right. This is what I'm talking about. <laughs> so, Rosie, you've got uh, a secondary fire on R1 now, which you can power up. Ooh. If you hold it down, you'll see. 
Oh, nice. nice. Okay, so I'm War, Rosie Strife. Good luck, everyone. Woo! Now, where's the... It's oh, over is, there. Is it just a double jump? Oh, oh we look so beautiful. Cool. We look beautiful. That was cool. Um... Uh, I think we're supposed to go over there, but I want to check out down here too. I know, yeah. that's... Oh! Hello. No, Strife, what happened? Strife! <laughs> no, Rosie's dead. No, Strife just went woo! I think you're back. Oh, I'm you back. are back. Oh, maybe we're not supposed to go down here. I mean, maybe we are supposed to go down here, but I... Well, that's where we're going anyway. Can I get up there? I don't feel like I can. Do you feel like I can? Mm. Oh, yeah, maybe. Maybe. You gotta wish... Uh, uh. No, help, No, come help. back, come back, come back. <laughs> Can I, like, stand on your back? I don't think so. I don't think it's that kind of... Uh... No, I can't. All it right. was worth... I think, we've, I think we might have... Overstepped our boundaries. Overstepped our bounds, yeah. Let's go back up, back up. No, Strife, Strife, Strife! You missed <laughs> the end! <laughs> come on, Strife. What about Strife? What about Struth? Struth. <laughs> Struth, Rosie. Do you think that was meant to be his actual name and then everyone just accidentally called him Strife? Struth. I don't know what Struth means. I mean, I know what it means, but I don't know. It feels like it's short for something. Or... That wall looked a bit weak, so I was like, oh, maybe we can break it. Do you think it's... Okay, I can see something over here. Come on, fight us, you cowards! You cowards! Alright, yeah, we're definitely supposed to smash this up. Are oh you my friendly? God. Are you a friendly thing? Are you a friendly thing? I don't think that's very friendly. Ooh. What's that? It looks cool. <gasps> a Vorpal blade Ooh. can be charged and thrown at multiple targets, including enemies, wall, wall switches, and objects. Okay. So who's got the Vorpal blade? Is it me or is it you? Uh. Each horseman can discover and utilize special gear items that can be used to solve puzzles. I was just said I wanted puzzles. Puzzles. Open new areas and provide additional benefits in combat. Select gear with. Left, up, or right. Strife uses gear with R3. War uses gear with R2. Probably War, because he's, he's just got a grab at the moment. Yeah. Well, I, but I think we both have it. I think we oh. can both choose. So you've got a grab as well. Nice. Strife's on R3. Yes. So you're... Okay, so equip the Vorpal Blade. You can also hold... Rope. Okay, gear. Move R... Blah, blah, blah. R2 for me. R3 for you. Yes. Got it. Okay. So, let me... So, so, yeah, I've got... I want the blade on. Are you going to keep the hook on? I've got you, the do you have the blade as well? Oh, no, you only do have the hook. That's sad. No, no it's just, just the hook for you. If I were me, I'd just be like, yup. A yup. A yup. <laughs> That's what we say. And a alley-oop. Alley-oop. All right. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to do this bit yet. No, okay. no I want to try this bit. Hang on. Aim the Vorpal Blade at the wall switch. But not. Yeah, I know, but there's two switches over here. We're just, I'm probably getting ahead of myself. I'll just do this one. Do What, what, what do you want to do? You you have the awesome ability. Oh, I was right about that wall. You were. But I want to unlock over here, Rosie, back where we were. Yes. There's definitely... Yeah, there were blue lights. There's things. two, weren't there? Yeah. So, I, want, I don't know how... Oh, this, will do, this is going to be a multiple situation. Aim the... Okay. Whoop. Yes! Yes! Maybe we should have gone through that other door. I don't know. Okay. What does this look like? It's story? Oh, it needs two keys. Oh, okay. Boom. We already had the keys. Oh, do you want to go that way? Oh, should we try the other one? Yeah, I think we should try the other oh, one. Oh, getting no, nervous. No, 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 no. Getting nervous. <laughs> I'm excited. It might be an item. It might just be a, a happy treasure chest. 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 I love a good bit of treasure. Uh, a few people suggesting we play Alienation. Alienation. Um, oh, here we go. Yep. A game that I have played, but only very briefly. The name rings a bell. I'm trying to remember what it was. Oh, nice. It's a sign of a top oh, down. No! Oh, no. I was like, did you hear the clicky time? The clicky time. Yeah, I was going at I didn't. You sounded like the one of the horsemen there. Come on. Come on, boy. Where is my horse? Oh, he was getting a, a notification there. You can lock on with L2, apparently. 
Oh, maybe that's for me. Uh, where are we going? Are we trying to get... Am I trying to... Lock on targets while aiming the ball blade with L2 and press R2. Throw. Okay, what do I need to aim at? Give me a target. Mm. Can you see... Uh, oh, maybe it's... But is it back here? Is it the same thing? Is this a something I can land on? It looks a bit too... No, okay. it's too deep. Hmm. Is it going to be spinning around on one of these things? It's spinning around. around. Get out of my way. Uh, I don't know. I can't see it. Hmm. Something to do with this old torch? No. Oh, that actually did hurt. That's not, that's not good. I don't think... Oh, okay, you can't glide for that long. The only <laughs> thing I'm wondering is if you stay there... Okay, I'll stay here. If I hit this, does it... Oh, God, I almost died. Does it affect... No, it doesn't No, change. it doesn't. It just gives you a area longer to, like, glide on more. Oh, ah, well, I don't know. I, su I suggest we carry on, then. Back to the, back the way we came. Oh, Johnny uh, Metology says, use the fire to light the torches. So you probably have to throw the boomerang through the fire and then uh, have it come around. Okay. Oh, All let's right. see if this works. Well, yep. Well, yep. I do like their wings. Their wings are very ah, cool. I see. That was a very useful tip. Then, thank right. you very much. No. Okay. I need to get sort of here. There you go. Not quite. Ooh. There we go. Nice. Well nice. Done. That was a pro tip. Thank you very much. I don't think I would have figured that out. What's this place? Oh, you're it's very alley. echoey. Uh, uh, a serpent. A serpent. A guy I've heard Just of. Just a guy. I heard of him somewhere. Don't ask me about him, it's fine. Oh, let's just hop into a, a serpent's hole, no problem. But now I'm like, should we have gone this way or the other way? I mean, what was the other way? I don't know. We, what, what? Oh, we've completed oh, chapter one, yay! yay. Enter the void. Having escaped Whoa, the siege. Whoa, he's running, he's going. Why is oh, he going? No. Oh, no, Rosie. <laughs> Having escaped the siege at Blackstone Keep, the horsemen make their way through the void to meet Samuel's associate. Strife just had enough of it. He just ran off on it by himself. He was like, nope. <laughs> nope, see ya. <laughs> see ya. How's everyone doing in the chat? What time is it? It's 4.30, so we've got about half an hour left to go. What's everyone think of... Uh, Genesis so far. Yeah. I'm I'm really, really enjoying it. Now we're hmm. now we're I was expecting <gasps> Ooh. Scary. Snake. A snakey guy. I'm a snag. Oh my god, I remember that video. Talk to Volgrim. I'm a snake. I'm a snake. I'm a leathery little snake. <laughs> <laughs> Have you found Volgrim? I'm following you. Are we going the right way? I don't know. I found this big old rock. Hmm. But maybe I haven't gone the I right way. I don't think way. this is the right way. No, oh, you're we've got to talk to Volgrim anyway. He's down here. Oh, is he? Yeah. Hey, Volgrim, right? The Soul Eater. Yeah. What a great name. Like me, your reputation precedes you. Have you any delicious Samuel Jackson. That's a guy, our friend. Council of Ooh, Ooh, that was a good, good laugh. laugh. Yeah, well, I bet that guy did it in one take. <laughs> and he was the nail like, that's it, in the bag. We got it. Killing me would prove tragic. You'd be trapped in the void for eternity. 
patience isn't my brother's thing. Or mine. Oh, are they siblings? I think it's more figurative. The Lords of Hell are forever in conflict. They're the worst. No, I hate them. They're always causing mischief. They are. What's he offering? If you wish no more, we must enter into an agreement. Okay. Recover an artifact. I wanted to hear complicated. I was like, I like the pause. Complicated. Just the face of Shall we say a little bit? A little bit complicated. It'll be worth your while. Go away. Oh, another serpent hole. Lovely. Oh, we got something nice. We've got horses, by the way. Yeah, we we can get there ourselves. Thank you very much. The keeper of my artifact will be less than pleased to see you. Oh, oh. That sound good. Do yours for the right price. What? What have you got? What have you got? What have you, what have you got? Creature cores unlocked. Creature cores. If I ask him, will he? So we can buy things. I don't know what any of these things are or why we want them. Use these keys to open mysterious trickster doors. Okay, we've got a couple of those. A piece of health stone for war. Okay, so that like upgrades your maximum health. Maximum health. Maximum wrath. Maximum health. Maximum wrath. Okay, lovely. What upgrades do you have? Potion uses plus one. That could be good. Oh, that's handy. Max potion count by one. I think that might be quite good. I'm going to get that. Do it. Do whatever your yes. instincts... We got loads of money. We we still have, got we've got a bit. We are like right at the start. So I feel like it's going to be gone. What's Thunderclap? Fires out a bolt of lightning, dealing <gasps> damage to a target in Argonne. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! On any Chuck Chelsea, uh, attack to fire out a bolt of lightning. Attack power is permanently increased. That sounds good. Is that for me or for you? Or can either of us use it? Static shock must f must be for you, I would have thought. Static shock. I like thund thunderclap. Thunderclap. Thunder, thunder, the thunder, thunderclap. Thunder 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 That's going to take all our money, though. I'm going to say let's not buy it now. Let's look at creature cores. What's a creature core? Is it like a summon? Unlocks the level one shadow caster creature core. Reviving a player heals the instigator for ten percent of max health. That's good. Don't know what they are really. That one's pretty. That one's Unlocks orange. Angelic beast creature core improves evade window by two frames. Oh, nice. I don't know. Wraith, phantom, shadow caster. I'm just going to leave all these because I have no idea what any of it means. Not going to spend any of our money. No. Take that, Soul Eater. You only got like 800. Yeah, 800 souls. Enjoy them. We got 3,000 and it's 400 and something. Do you think this is the way we're going? It looks like what? Well, it looks like it's not ready to be Do unlocked yet. Do we need a yet. trickster key? Maybe that maybe. is a lot of key. It's, it's, there's only one little portion of it lit. But maybe that's what we need the key for. Yeah. Maybe this guy's like. Mm -hmm. Well, we've we've already got some keys. Do we? Yeah, yeah. We I found two in the lot before before you joined. I found two. So I think they, they must be. Are they in here? In the collection. Wraith. No, you got no tricks to keys. I do. You don't. I got key. I bought. I found some keys. You got nothing. Oh, though. in each chapter, they can be found hidden through. So I've We're got none in this none in this room. I don't think. Well, we'll let's buy one for the sake of argument. Go on. So you could spend a measly five hundred souls. You're a bad influence. You are. <laughs> look, look. We need nine. Oh no. So I've already got C three out of nine. There you go. I don't think it's going to work though. No. No. No joy. No. No dice. Well, at no least now dice. we have a trickster key. Oh, Johnny says thunderclap is most useful indeed. Well, now we've spent. We can't buy it. Stupid trickster key. Don't even need it. God. All right. I think we're going this way, Rosie. I think. Well, we could go to the right. Let's go down here. This looks nice down here. This is quite cool. So yeah, this looks very cool. It looks like downstairs. They've got the neon, neon light going on. Like our office. Exactly. This is this is what our office looks like. What our office, our communal area looks like downstairs now. Is this like Volgrim's? Little workshop. Maybe. 
Well, I don't think this is for us either, is it? Doesn't it's my little anything. potion shop. It's complicated. <laughs> <laughs> you got to you got to do more of a pause than that. I know, but I failed it if I did the pause longer. Oh, no. Then the joke wouldn't be picked up on. Right, okay. <laughs> so it was kind of like the fearful moment. Yes. I suppose one could say. They're a bit. Little <laughs> Maybe. Complicated. Um, well, we've got to open that door somehow. Do you think? Yeah. You think it's definitely that door? I reckon so. Well, someone... Uh, buh, buh, buh. Oh, SLR409 said you used them on the door you ran away from. But we need like a million. Well, I don't know how many we need. But it looked, oh, it what's like this? This has done a thing. Oh, is it just like we can use that serpent hold again now? Yes. This <laughs> is, oh, no, Rosie, I'm going to die now. Oh. <laughs> did, you, did you carry on it running? Turns out, it turns out when someone presses circle on that, on that it, the, the other player just continues in the direction. Yeah, they're just like, wee. Okay. The slag pit. Let's <laughs> do it. There's nothing funny about that, Rosie. Slag pit is a thing <laughs> from from mines. From mines, is it? From mines, yeah. What's it? What's it for? <laughs> a slag. I think it's from mines, or is it? It's from industry. Like coal, a big mound of slag. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. We stop <laughs> laughing. That is absolutely <laughs> correct. But well, what is? In mining terms, <laughs> what slag. Is slag. It's like I think it's like detritus. It's like what leftover rubbish, like l like useless rocks. Okay, like right. Put it in the slag pit. <laughs> okay. Nothing funny that's about that. That's fair. That's fair. Go back to the treasure room, says SLR four hundred nine. You've just wasted keys. Well, oh. we don't, we're, we're, I <laughs> we're didn't learning. Even want the key. We're learning. <laughs> Screams of suffering cages. Uh, we're definitely a dungeon. Troubling demon. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right, cool. Let's do it. Ooh. Oh, there we go. What's the time? Okay, we've got about 20 minutes. 20 <laughs> glorious minutes to find this artifact. It's probably not going to happen. But now that bombs can be picked and th picked up and thrown to destroy bomb growths. What's a bomb growth? Can I shoot it while it's in your hand? I hope not, Rosie, to be honest. <laughs> no, I can't. If you fancy not doing that, that would be fine. Yeah, we used to key, I think. No, I think we oh. we need one. Uh, sorry, I'm just going to look. I want to see what a bomb growth is. I wonder if it's that. Do you think it's that over there? Can you throw it at that, that stuff? No. Yes. Oh, yes. How did you throw it? Um, R2. I aimed and then pressed R2. Okay, cool. So what's that? Chamber of iron. Maybe we need another one. Let's have a look. Come here, Bob. Blow. Oh, they got caught on the wall. Is that doing anything more? I don't know. Can you throw it directly at the purple thing? Out of interest. No, no joy. Hmm. Well, we should probably just go for the door. Oh, did that do a thingy over here? Don't think so. Oh, it just looked cool. Okay. It just looked really cool. Magic powers! Done. Out the door! Da, 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 da. Oh. Mistress Kasumi says hello and good morning. Hello, hello, it's hello! It's been too long. Why has it been so long, Mistress Kasumi? <laughs> Why, no, where, have you been? where have you been? Why has it been What's so long? Hope you're uh, doing well. Thank you for joining us. Beam shot. This is for you, Rosie. Nice. I fire a steady beam of energy, dealing damage at a rapid rate and building hot streak quickly. Ooh. Hot streak. A larger empowered beam pierces enemies. Passive attack power is permanently increased for each ammo type acquired. That's good. So, so yeah, this hold is you. L1 and use that right nice. R2, R1. Brilliant. What a sign to do. So you just have to choose whether it's an R2 or an R1 mm. power for Yeah, you. let's go with a standard. There we go. Uh, no, wait. So you're just using, just uh. going to use, not not going to use any standard stuff. Oh, it's powerful. I should love... Decisions. Okay. Whoa. Look at you go. You don't oh have uh, infinite ammo, just so you know. 
of that. You see the purple bar at the bottom. That's yeah, it. but it looks really cool. Yeah, <laughs> not infinite though, Rosie. It's not, not infinite still. Meanwhile, I'm in trouble over here. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not really. I'm war. I'm absolutely fine. I'm war. Open sesame. More souls for us. Nice. Why are you purple? What's going on with you? Ooh. Who are you? Why are you purple? A slag flea. <laughs> flea mag explosions have a 25% chance to not interrupt players. Nice. Okay, thanks. I guess we'll, we'll, we'll take that. Boosh. Is that a coffin? How do we get up there? Hmm. Not here. Oh. You're being a cheeky monkey up there. Oh. That's what they call me. Cheeky monkey. Cheeky so monkey. does the purple, do the little purple boxes, do they, um, do they refill your ammo? Maybe, I'm not sure. Discovered Boatman's Coin. Yeah, that's like a kind of currency that we need to use with Volgrim. Let's see, what's this treasure box? Money, I think. Green stuff. Okay. Yes. Oh, we've got so many lovely things. Vroom, vroom. Uh, okay, cool. I think. What was this blue thing? Is it to do with that? I saw a big blue ball. Oh, it's that's gone what we. Now. Oh, what that ball? Yeah. It's not that. Hmm. Can you shoot the big uh, orange ball? Let's have a look. Might be something to do with my beam shot since I have just got that. Uh, let's have a look. There we go. Well done, Dave. Well, that's good. Oh, well, you thought... just take all the credit for it. Do they all go to you? I don't think so. Oh, maybe not. I think we have a shared. I think we have a shared. Blind. I just saw them go in the opposite <laughs> direction to me, and I was like, oh. So where are we going now? Hmm. Maybe there's some anything here I can shoot. Nope. Is it over here. Over here. It's not. We've already done this, haven't we? We've already done that bit. Maybe we just need to go back. Maybe that's. No, that's not the artifact. Come uh. and come and join me. I think it must be to do with that bomb. What? The one that we just destroyed. No, you know. Uh, you know the yeah the the, the thing we picked the bomb up thing it mm. said it seemed like we were getting through to an, a new room but it didn't actually take us through there let's try throw it at these aha yes Perfect. i saw someone in the chat earlier saying like to the left of it and i was like but there's a wall so i was like you know what, let's just throw a bomb there well these guys are lavery nice that is. I know, I want to know what. Can we do it? Did we have we. I don't think so. I don't think we can do anything to it. Oh well. We're going down into hell. Into the chamber of iron. Not quite hell, but it's got a lot of iron. Well, there must be a lot of slag if there's a lot of, you know, a lot of iron. True being that, a, true yeah, that. Being an iron mine. You trying to throw your lava at me? You throw your lava at me, sir. For the balance. This is cool. I'm. I think so too. I'm sad that we don't have our. Can I? Can you get on your horse again? Yeah. You can get on your horse anytime. It's L1 and R1. Because I thought that, but it wasn't letting me go on my horse. Oh really? Yeah, and then I got sad. Oh yeah, it seems like maybe horses aren't allowed oh, in no, there. This is the forbidden area. The chamber for the of iron. I mean, it doesn't look very horse friendly, to be fair. Oh yes, it's red now. Oh. Oh wow, really? Was that your laser? That was my laser, your and it was worth getting knocked off beam. the edge. Did you get knocked off the edge? Yeah, he was just—he was not having oh, it. Oh, it's gone slow mo. Oh no, I'm ill, Dave. Oh, are you? Okay. Yeah, right, I'm I'll down. Come, I'll come and get you. I was doing too many cool, awesome lasers. 
How do I help you? Oh, I'm nearly dead. Where are you? I'm at the bottom. Oh, no, right. I'm at the I thought that was you. I thought that was you. All right, don't worry. You'll be back. Oh, well, I got eight seconds. Seven. Well, this is what happens when you die. But now we know. <laughs> now it's good we know. that we found this out. I honestly thought that you were uh, the big dragon man. I don't know why. The big dragon man. Right, here now we go. That, I'm back. Now that I say it out loud, it doesn't seem to make much sense. All right. It's time for me to use my thing. Your epic boomerang. Boom. Orang. Right, we need the bomb. Over here, Rosie. What, in this? Yeah, and that. Boosh. Bosh. Let's see, is there anything else? Can I throw it at these little old rocks? Oh, went too far that way. <laughs> Got here. What's this? Oh, I need your assistance. Come in. Come to the big golden thing, please. Ooh. I require the your assistance. As dangerous as a council says he is. Why are they send just the two of us? That's a good point. Because yeah. we are amazing. Because Charlie. yeah, we are the. Do you doubt our abilities? There you go. It's fury, death, and fury. Not not envy. That's the the other four. That's the other two horsemen, death and fury. Which one's the lady with pink hair? Fury. Fury. the question your wardrobe. But I still think your armor could use some more creepy faces on you. Must everything be a joke to you? Must you, everything you be really a joke to you, idiot! Why do I have to be put up with you? I'm war! Oh, is he going to do an actual joke? No. Knock, knock. Who's there? <laughs> Why would I give away my location? <laughs> I would simply smash through the door and face my assistant. Yes, uh, war! That's good war. Good uh, warring. You're hopeless. Oh, I wanted to hear the actual joke, but you war's joke that. was very good. Ruin that dad joke. This looks like a kind of a bossy area. The slag heap. These glyphs indicate some kind of locking mechanism. They do. It seems our mission is more difficult than we How do we? Oh, there's a thing. Get it. You're the only one who can get it, unfortunately. Let's go. Should we go together? Yeah. Where? Which way did you go? I went that way. Yeah, that way. Oh dear. Oh, map. Map. Oh, yeah, map of the slag pit. Perfect. Oh, there's a lot of fire down here. A lot of fiery. fiery oh, bits. wow. You caused a lot of mess down here. I did. Sorry. Uh, Alright. Did that Did that do anything to the lock? Doesn't look like it, does it? it I'll, tell like, you, I'll try. Oh, I'm going to go another way. I think we might need a bomb. Is there a bomb anywhere? Uh, there was um, earlier. <laughs> I'll try this way. Alright, you try that way. Oh. Okay, that looks good. Oh, oh my god, that was scary. Ooh oh my it? god, knives! I didn't see them at first. I'm going to push. Knives? Yeah, oh. they were like, no, I was like jumping away and then they were like, haha, spikes! Haha, oh. -ha, spikes! Yes, yeah, he Oh no! Oh. So you're on the other side of me! See, there are the spikes. Come on, quick, 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 go. There we go, nice. Where nice. did you come from then? If you were on the other side. I, I just, I followed behind you. Oh, did you? Yeah. I struggled with this bit. Up he goes. Come on now, Wall. There we go. Don't have all the fun without me. I'm going to have all the fun without you. Woohoo! Oh, I just saw oh, the, I just saw the, the button. Oh, this is I just saw a button we have to press. I was too taken aback by the screen thing. I was like, what's the screen thing? I want it. Ah, oh, health. Brilliant. Yeah, what was that green thing? Oh, it was health, was it? Yeah. It's full of health. Lovely, lovely health. Help. Slashy, slashy, slashy. Oh, it's just a really good, fun game. Hmm. Okay, so up here, I thought I thought I saw the button. Look, there's the button up there. You see? Oh, yeah, At I the see. Top. So we need, we need some Oh, there's bombs. a bomb over there. There's bombs, like, in the wall. Oh, yeah. Oh, can you, ghost, can you grab it with your ghost hook? Oh. Yeah. Ah, that's right. Uh, what, what am I throwing at? You could definitely this? try and throw it over here as uh -huh. well. There's a few things. Did you get it? Yeah, I think I did. You got something, right? Okay. Yeah. What, do you want me to throw it at? Uh, maybe just that giant crystal. I don't know if that will explode, but... It's like. 
Um, because I think now we can. I'm gonna try it. Yeah. Uh, nice. Oh no! <laughs> Rosie to the top. Last one. There's a loser. Oh, no, oh Rosie's a loser. Oh, Sorry, I'm a Rosie. loser. <laughs> so is that undoing the lot? Yes, we've undone one of them. That's good. So I think we might need more bombs. Well, I'll take one with me. Oh, I forgot to use that, Rosie. Now I'm the loser. <laughs> Dave's loser. No oh, I that. can't carry him. <laughs> no need for that. <laughs> Calm down now. Okay, how do we, how do we get back though? You have to you have to glide across. Oh, what from the top? Did you already go this way? No, I haven't okay. yet. Okay, do that. I've made it to the pillar. Oh, there's a grapple. Whoa, off I go. There we go. Right, I'm a coming. Right, here oh we go. Oh, God, there's quite a lot of them, Rosie. Whoop! I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh, he's angry. He's a bit upset with us. I'm war. You can't do that to me. Alright, okay. What have we got here? It's another one. Down Ooh, he goes. I like the a, circle of attack. I Just have time for a nose scratch there. That's how. That's how much damage I was doing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so cool at this. I can just nose scratch, scratch my nose. I think if you shoot that orange thing behind you, yeah, yeah. exactly. That's there's some lovely souls in there. Nice. And we've just what stolen all of them. Oh yeah. Nowhere. Yes, another button. Oh, hang on. We've got a big lad. We've got, we got a big got, lad. I've got another lad behind you. Let me get rid of this lad. I did just do quite no. He's not down yet. This Ow. calls for a big gun! Oh dear. Oh, I've been knocked off the edge! <gasps> That's Ooh, me! That is me. I'm back. This guy's going all over the place. He was just like, woo! Have a super. I'm gonna do a, a wrathy thing. I'm so full of wrath! Oh no! <sighs> Help me, I'm down! Okay, we can do this this time. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I need. No! no! You're okay. Okay, are you still okay? I'm dying. I'm coming. Oh god, I'm nearly dead. Uh, you're up. Oh my god, you're a hero. I am, thank you. Right, let's get rid of this guy. Get this is, rid this of is, this guy. This is like the first test we've had, I feel. Well, the first time where, where our friendship's put to the test. Really, it was, wasn't it? And you saved me, Dave. We came we through it. We have a strong friendship. We came through it. I knew we would. Bonk. Bosh. Bosh. Yes. Did it. Okay, that's good. We've done that one. I think there's, what's more, there's more over here. Ooh. Ooh, a thingy. Don't mind if I do. Souls. Nom, nom, souls. nom, 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 nom. I got souls because I am a soldier. <laughs> I think war War should be a soldier, shouldn't he? He should be a soldier. Oh, I mean. oh that's you. I think. <laughs> Surprise. Yeah. I don't feel like this is. I feel the like right maybe way. we have to go back up here. Yeah. Glide. Oh no! Go back! Ah! <laughs> oh, that was close. I'm gonna. Oh yeah, there we go. Here we go. Strive, Ooh. go back in. Oh my gosh. Oh, I only just made it. Okay, there we go. Oh, that was close. I think it's over here. Oh, there's. That's what I need. I'm not gonna make that. Damn it. <laughs> Strife's wings. And she's just floating in the air. <laughs> I'm floating in, in the, the air. air. Right, one more, one more. We've got five minutes to do this, Rosie. I think we can do it. Yeah, let's do this. Right, which way we've got to go? Oh, so now we know we've got to do it that way. I mean, I did go this way to begin with. I think this is where we need the bomb again. I don't know if there's one that you can see that you could grab anywhere. Or something that I can do. Oh, we're not supposed to go up here, are we? Hmm. No. Oh, wait, there's a plank over this way. Oh, I just, yeah. I just didn't see that. How weird. You had to kind of be a bit of a daredevil. Okay, yeah. Oh, this looks like a job for your lava boomerang. That's definitely not me. Oh, dear. Boom! Stop attacking me! Please, thank you. You can still be polite, even when you're angry. There we go. Shot that guy. Let's use a 
big lift. Yes. Okay, I can't get up there yet. I need to do something. But what? Oh, I got a bum. I got a bum. Okay, cool. So throw it. You need to throw it back. I don't know. I, this fire, this... To the middle. You oh. see where I am? Yeah. Like past me, there's a big... There's a big chunker. Got it. A big chunker. That, it's not it's not gone off though. Try it. Oh, can you throw another one or is that one... Maybe i got to throw it from like closer. Let's have a look. Oh, I can't glide. Oh, it's okay. Whew. Come on now. Surely this is the place, right? This is the place for the... Don't you think that's the place? Well, it looks like that torch could be lit, so I'm going to try and throw it at the ah, torch. Ah, torch is a good shot. Okay. Between objects using the Vorpal Blade. Nope. <laughs> okay. So you could oh, fire to so that, and then you got to light the torch, I think. Okay, let's try that. That worked. Didn't look like it worked. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it did. It sort that on fire. Okay. And then do it on, yeah, this one here to my left. Can't see where that's going. Is that it? Yes. You did it. And this one straight across. Okay. Um. Okay, that's done something. We've got ourselves a chest. Got a chest. That's a good thing. I don't know how we get into it though. Can I have my? And I, I want to try and open that one. Oh, now it's blown up. Oh, it has. Yeah, Amazing. We got two floating ones. Nice. Just get rid of these quick. We don't need these. <laughs> Yes. No, okay, yes, good. Woo! We solved the puzzle. We're through. Deactivate the final do? room. Oh, there's one there. Okay, back this way. Hang on. Oh, I just opened a thing. Ah! Oh, God, I don't know what I've done. Ah! Oh, no. What's happened? Why am I dead? Why can't we open this? Do you need a trickster key? Oh, maybe, yeah. I don't have one. All right, I'm coming back anyway. What have we got to do, Rosie? I think there's one down, like, where we started, I think. Okay. One that maybe we missed or something. Is that can we, right? like, can we, like, go down here? No, nope, I oh, don't Oh, well, yeah, there's th this one wasn't on before. Oh, so you just had to do that. Oh, Whoa! you just get the big lad. Okay, so this will be the end of the stream, then. <laughs> we'll defeat the big lad. Oh, dear, he's... He's a big lad. Hang on, He's I'm coming back. He's a big back. boy. Oh dear, I didn't really realise that you weren't here. Oh. And now I'm full. It's kind of I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Oh my god. Okay. To be fair, he's left me alone ever since. All right, yeah, you shoot him. I'll get behind him and run away. See if I can get a good old laser. 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 Whoa. Yes, he hates it. He hates it. He hates us because we are the horsemen. We are the horsemen. We are the horsemen. Okay, he seems to really like following me, so okay, I'm going to keep fine. on shooting. Yeah, you keep doing that, and I'm going to... Oh, missed him. I dodged at the wrong time. Just going to get some hell. Excuse yeah, me, he little really, one. He really only has eyes for you. I know. I'm, well, I mean, I can't tell a lot. <laughs> <laughs> you. I'm the one with the smooth skin. Yeah, that's true. I was going <laughs> to say, actually, I'll never get that. Come on, you demon. <laughs> he must be He must be in a pretty bad way by now. No, he's, only, he's not even halfway. My gun, it's good at long range, but it doesn't do a lot of damage, I don't think. Right. I'm going to try getting closer to him. Come on, get out of here. It is working, though. Like, you know, you're... Uh your far away approach. Wow, I'm hardly doing any damage to him. I wish we had Thunderclap. Oh my god, if only we bought that! I Yay. know! Imagine Thunderclap on this bad boy! Just getting some of the ads. I feel like Lara Croft at the moment. Just what? shooting away. You feel like Lara Croft? Yeah, right. like Lara Croft. Yeah. Hey, that was good, wasn't it? Uh, Temple of Osiris. Did you play that? Oh, I saw it. I had a friend who really, really liked it, and he was showing me it. It was uh, it was one of the PS Plus monthly games, I think, years ago. And that's how I got into it. I really enjoyed it. Ooh, ah, ha -ha. 
You're nearly down. Yes, that's it, Dave. At Another least. one of them. A yeah, get the laser, beam on. Big, have one of these. I have a oh. big laser. Oh, he's down, Rosie. He's down. Yes, wait. I is think, he down? I think so. I'm killing him from over crevasse. Oh, yes. 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 Slag Demon. Slag Demon is dead. Dashing has a 25% chance to leave behind a lava trail, dealing very light damage based on wrath powers over five seconds. Thank it's you. Not so troubling Complicated. <laughs> 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 and here I thought you were warming up. How can we say that? I don't want to know. If we're honest, I would like to. Complicated. <laughs> <laughs> That's my new favorite thing. Can we can we get there? Oh yeah, here we go. I wonder what this thing's really worth to that soul-sucking ghoul. We could convince Volgrim to throw in a little extra. Yeah, I'd like a little extra. Wall's really enjoying his sword. He really is, just over and <laughs> over like, again. Let me just see me flex. Oh, he's calmed down now. There we go. Let us return to Volgrim then. For his sake. For his sake, I hope we find him. Hooray! Hooray! Look, Look at, at us go! Woo! We are the best! Two chapters! We are the best! Like a disco, like a cool disco. And we managed to we managed to finish at one minute past five. Wow, one minute overtime! Amazing. Thank you everybody for joining us. We are going to call it there. That seems like the perfect place. It does really, yeah. Can't top that. That was just a little taste of Darksiders Genesis, um, which came to PlayStation, I think, last I week? I think it was last Late week. Late last yeah. week. I have been super enjoying it. It was a um, lot of fun. It's been good to show off on the stream today. You can play it single player. You can play it split screen. You can play it online co-op as well. So... Um, all your base is covered there, and it's kind of dropping in out as well. I believe if Rosie were to leave now, that would be fine. I can carry on without her. So <laughs> hopefully you liked it. I really, really liked it. I've not played any of the other Dark Siders games apart from that stream we did of Dark Siders Three. Yes. And so you know, I'm not kind of predisposed to this world, but I think it's been fantastic. I love the world actually. It's yeah, really colourful really and interesting. Yeah. It's quite funny as well, which is nice. I love war. It's quite wry. So um, it's a bit complicated. I love War, the character. Yeah, as the well. War, the it's in the character. Need to be yeah. clear about that. So yeah, hopefully that was uh, that was a good time. We're going to be back streaming again on Thursday this week. Yes. Um, Rosie and I think Elle will be streaming. Um, I think we're going to be streaming Bayonetta. We are from the remastered, Ooh. which is great because I love Bayonetta. I have never played it. Oh, it's so, so good. I love Bayonetta. Oh, is it similar? I haven't had a Viennetta in ages. Me neither. Oh, my God. And they're like 90p. No, they're not that really expensive, aren't they? No, Rosie, they're definitely not really expensive. No, aren't they the ones with the swirly chocolate y Yes, on the they're not really expensive. I thought they were really expensive. No, you've, my mum used to call them a posh pudding. They're really not. Oh. They're really not. We'll, we'll look after this. We'll have a look. I'll, I'll get you one. Yeah. We'll have oh, one my God. In. We have we'll have one in this week. Yes. So, yeah, um, we've got plenty more coming this week. We've got a few more kind of videos on the side as well, little extra bits and pieces. So um, make sure you stick with us for the rest of the week. Thank you very much to our moderation team. Yes. For all your fantastic moderating. Uh, and just everybody who sticks with us and wants to be in our chat and talk to one another and enjoy yourselves. It's great that you all come and watch us play games. Yes. We're very happy. Hooray. So all that's left for us, left for us to do is the awkward wave goodbye. And uh, we'll see you later, basically. Yeah, Shall we do it? Let's do it. Let's start it now. It's a bit more awkward. It's <laughs> complicated. complicated. <laughs>